Hey, welcome back to CPK Design Co. Today we're going to be doing something a little bit different and I am showing you a daily spread. Also, this is a bit of a sneak peek of the planner that is gonna be coming to my shop in March. I'm super excited about it. I have used this planner for a couple years now that I made for myself and I just changed a few things and made sure that it was more accessible to everybody else and not just specific to me and so I'm in the testing stages to make sure everything's working properly and then I will be able to list it and I am so excited and um, so right now I am adding in the weather and my top priority so my top is laundry cleaning the kitchen and then my CBK drop since I moved my drops to Saturdays and I'm just going to bring in the little icons to mark that as well. Also, the kits that I am using in this video are the Book Lover Kit with the matching icons. I am adding in the menu for the day. You can use this to mark your breakfast, lunch, dinner, whatever you want to mark. I didn't want to set it to just three specific boxes because sometimes I'll skip lunch or I'll have dessert or snacks throughout the day. So I just wanted to leave that blank so you have a little bit more customization there. Now I am bringing in two of the arches and just decorating a little bit off to the side. I am going to add in February just to mark the month that we are on as well as the garland sticker. I'm adding in this mood tracker sticker which I eventually decided to take out but that will be a little bit later as well as a water goal and the energy tracker. Now I'm just filling in my schedule before I start decorating the rest of it. So I just have wake up, do the laundry, my CBK drop, and then I need to do some cleaning. And then I am using the dot pen. I love that new tool in GoodNote 6 and I'm just marking that. Instead of time blocking, I am just using the dotted line to mark the time frame I'm going to be doing something specific. And then I have some time for relaxing, dinner, TV binge, and going to bed. One thing I really love having on the daily spread is an affirmation area that just keeps you in a more positive mind frame and a state of gratitude so I just really like having that on the daily spreads. And then I'm also going to use this blank box to add a bit of decor. You can use that for anything if you need to add other notes or a shopping list or whatever you need that space for. I don't have too much going on this day so I just filled it in with some decor and now I am decorating the rest of the spread. I decided to move the energy bar and the water goal over to the bottom so that I can put this plant a little bit bigger on the sidebar. And I was bringing in the books and then decided not to. So I'm just playing around a little bit until I get it the way I like it. But this is an example of what you can do with the daily spread in the new planner coming out. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments below and I am looking forward to showing you more of sneak peeks of this thing. I'm so, so excited. I love this planner. I've been kind of intimidated to post one 
Um, but I just really, really love the one I have and I found planner piece with it. So I hope you guys will too. As always, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate the support I've been getting lately growing my little channel and your comments mean a lot to me and I hope to continue seeing you guys in the next ones. Bye!